Neil deGrasse's terrifying message about the Beetlejuice explosion. Stars have always been interesting to us because of how beautiful and mysterious they are. Scientists and the general public are both interested in Betelgeuse, a big red star, and the constellation Orion. Neil deGrasse Tyson, a well-known astrophysicist, recently sent out a message that has people both amazed and worried about what might happen to Betelgeuse. In this video, we'll talk about what Tyson said, what Betelgeuse is like, and what could happen if it blew up. Let's take a closer look at Betelgeuse to see why Tyson's message is so important. This star is about 700 light years away from Earth. It is one of the biggest stars we know of in our Milky Way galaxy. It has a bright red light and is part of the well-known Orion constellation. The age and size of Betelgeuse make it a likely candidate for a supernova. Neil deGrasse Tyson, a respected astrophysicist who is known for being able to explain complicated ideas in a way that everyone can understand, recently said some scary things about Betelgeuse. He brought up the idea that the star could explode, which would cause a supernova. Scientists and the general public have both been excited and worried about this. If Betelgeuse went supernova, it would be a rare event that would have a big impact. The explosion would release a huge amount of energy and make a bright flash of light that could be seen even during the day. Even though Betelgeuse is pretty far away, its explosion could still cause a lot of trouble. One possible effect is that it could change the night sky. The explosion would be very bright, and for a short time, Betelgeuse might shine brighter than the moon. It would be beautiful to look at, but its brightness could make it hard to study the sky for a while. Another effect could be the release of dangerous radiation. Gamma rays are one type of particle that can come out of a supernova. Even though Earth's atmosphere shields us from most of these harmful rays, it is still possible that some of them could reach us and change the climate of our planet or even harm our health. Even though the idea of Betelgeuse going supernova is interesting, no one knows when it will happen. Scientists can't say with any accuracy when a star will blow up. It might happen tomorrow or in a thousand years. But because Betelgeuse is old and has changed in recent years, its explosion could happen in our lifetimes or those of people who come after us. Betelgeuse's possible explosion is important for a number of reasons. First of all, we need to study supernovae to learn more about how stars change over time and about the universe as a whole. Scientists have a unique chance to watch and study the different stages of a supernova and Betelgeuse, from the first explosion to the formation of a neutron star or black hole. Second, the explosion of Betelgeuse would teach us a lot about how massive stars die and die again. It would help scientists test and improve their current theories and models, which would help them learn more about how the universe works. Also, a Betelgeuse supernova would be a great place to study how heavy elements are made and where they go in the universe. Supernovae create elements other than iron. These elements include gold, silver, and uranium. These elements are important parts of planets, life as we know it, and the stars and galaxies that will come after us. When people talk about a supernova, one question that often comes up is how it might affect our planet. Due to Betelgeuse's distance from Earth, which is about 700 light years, a supernova would not have many direct effects. Over such long distances, the destructive forces of the explosion, like shock waves and radiation, would weaken a lot. But it's important to remember that a supernova's energy explosion could still affect Earth in some way. For example, the increase in cosmic rays that could come from the explosion could change the atmosphere and climate of Earth. Scientists would keep a close eye on any changes in the chemistry of the air and how particles interact with each other so they could figure out what the long-term effects would be. The possibility of a Betelgeuse supernova has caught people's attention and made them curious and excited. The idea of seeing a cosmic event of this size is irresistible, which shows that people have always been interested in the universe. Also, a Betelgeuse explosion would have an effect on culture that goes beyond science. It would inspire artists, writers, and storytellers to explore new stories and themes based on this amazing event. Scientists are keeping a close eye on Betelgeuse because of rumors that it might explode. 
Advanced telescopes and instruments are pointed at Betelgeuse to collect data and study its changes in size, brightness, and other things that can be seen. These ongoing observations are very important for understanding how the star is right now and figuring out how it will change in the future. Scientists are especially interested in studying Betelgeuse's mass loss because big stars like it lose a lot of mass before they go supernova. By looking closely at these processes, scientists hope to learn more about the things that happen before a supernova, such as how mass is lost and a dense core is made. Also, work is being done to make it easier for us to find and predict supernovae. Researchers are making advanced models and simulations to better predict when and if Betelgeuse will explode and to learn more about how these events affect their surroundings. Scientists from all over the world are working together because of the possibility of a supernova in the star Betelgeuse. Astronomical observatories, research institutions, and space agencies are combining their resources and knowledge to collect as much data as possible. Scientists are working together on international projects and initiatives, which gives them a global view of how to study Betelgeuse and other stars like it. This group effort is driven not only by scientific curiosity, but also by a shared sense of responsibility to learn more about the universe and get ready for any possible effects of a supernova. Neil deGrasse Tyson's message about the explosion of Betelgeuse has gotten people interested in and curious about the wonders of the universe. It shows how important it is for scientists and the general public to be able to talk to each other about science. In response to this public interest, educational outreach programs and science centers have been taking the chance to teach and engage people of all ages. By helping people learn more about science and encouraging the next generation of astronomers, these projects help science move forward and make sure the public stays informed and interested in new astronomical discoveries. If Betelgeuse exploded, it would be the end of a star's life, but it would also be the start of a very interesting event in the universe. A supernova remnant is what's left after a supernova. It can last for thousands of years and can teach scientists a lot. One of the most important things that would happen after a Betelgeuse supernova is that a neutron star, or in some cases, a black hole, would form. Neutron stars are so dense that they can fit the mass of several suns into a sphere that is only 20 kilometers across. Their strong gravitational pull and fast spins create a very strong magnetic field which make them great places to study basic physics and strange states of matter. If Betelgeuse were big enough, it could collapse into a black hole, which is an object with so much gravity that nothing, not even light, can get away from it. If a black hole were to form, scientists could study the limits of what they know about gravity and the way space-time works. If you like this video, don't forget to click like, share, and subscribe so you can see more exciting scientific adventures. And as always, tell us what you think and let us know how much you enjoyed our video. We'll see you next time.